It's funny, the last time I was here, Kinwa and I were trying to convince Ulfric to come up to a peace meeting. Kinda of funny to think we're here to join his cause now. Yeah, funny. You're still not quite sure about this whole thing, are you? I mean... The last time we were here, he gave a, an amazing speech about... You know, bleeding for Skyrim, but... I don't know, just look around. I'm not sure how much of the city actually reflects him. Eh, it can't be all bad. They demand the moot. And damn the moot! We should risk letting those milk drinkers put Torek's woman on the throne? She'll hand Skyrim over to the elves on a silver plate. All the more reason, then. The crown would legitimize your claim. What exactly do we want? The crown on? doesn't make a king. It's a good no. question. But this one... If it even exists. It exists. And it will be the symbol of the righteousness of our cause. Think about it. Should we just walk in a there? A jagged crown. It's up to you. It heralds You're back the one to who knows a time Galmar. before Jarls and Moots. Yeah, that's fair. Back to the time when the king right, let's go was a it. king because his enemies fell before him. And his people rose because they loved him. Skyrim needs that king. You will be that king, Ulfric. You must be. You're certain you found it? When have I ever been false with you? Fine. I'll send the unblooded here with you. What you call me? Fancy a crawl through a moldering dungeon to see if you can't stir up Garmar's jagged crown. <laughs> that sounds familiar. It will be there. You'll see. You're alive. I owe Ulfric a drink. I have to admit, I didn't think we'd be seeing you again. You hoped you would be, I misjudged anyway. you. You're definitely Stormcloak material. Thank you. It's time we made this official. You ready to take the oath? What oath? Your leader. I want you to As long... Here's, here's my condition, Message Galmar, for turning me away the first two times I spoke to you about this. Why, sir? It will work. The three of us are here to join your cause. Would you have all of us take this oath? Before you're one of us, you must swear fealty to Jarl Ulfric Stormcloak, future High King of Skyrim. You must also pledge unswerving loyalty to your fellow Stormcloaks, to Skyrim, and to her people. Isn't it enough that we want to fight the Imperials? You can stick a sword through an Imperial any day you want, but that doesn't make you a Stormcloak. Hey, We're not fair. just fighting Imperials. We're fighting to restore Skyrim to her glory and give her the king she deserves. All right. You two ready? Hey. Uh, yeah, I guess so. All right, let's let's do this then. Let's be Stormcloaks. And if you call me, uh, just watch your mouth, Galmar. All right. That's the spirit. By swearing this oath, you become one of us. A heroine of the people. A true daughter of Skyrim. A Stormcloak. Repeat after me. I do swear my blood and honor to the service of Ulfric Stormcloak. I do, I do swear my blood and honor to the service of Ulfric Stormcloak. Jarl of Windhelm and true High King of Skyrim. Jarl of Windhelm and true High King, true King of Skyrim. Skyrim. As Talos is my witness, <laughs> may this oath bind me to death and beyond. You're all right, Kinoa? Yeah, I'm fine. Go for it. As, As Talos, Talos is, is my witness, witness may this, this oath, oath bind me to death and beyond. beyond. Even to my lord, as to my fellow brothers and sisters in arms. Even, Even to, my to my lord, lord as, as to my fellow brothers, brothers and sisters, sisters in arms. All hail the Stormcloaks, 
The true sons and daughters of Skyrim. All hail the Stormcloaks, the true sons and daughters of Skyrim. Now you're one of us. Which means you get to tag along on a little trip with me. Oh, and here. You're a Stormcloak now. You ought to look the part. I look the part enough already. Oh, fine. Alright. Watch yourself out there. You're just going to walk away without telling us where we're going? See, this is why we had words the last oh, time I was here. Get yourself kitted out with what you need. Welcome to the fight. Hmm. Where are we going? What are we doing? We're here? We're Stormcloaks. We haven't a clue what's going on yet. I have found the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. Can you believe it? Well, I'm almost certain. We're headed to Corvanjun. <laughs> but if old King Borgus is indeed buried there, we're bound to run into trouble of some kind. Your fellow Stormcloaks are already assembling outside the tomb. I'll meet you there as soon as I'm finished up here. First of all, it's pronounced Corvanjund. And how do you know the crown is there? It's true. The location of the crown was lost with King Borgas after the Great Hunt killed him while he was off on his damned Alessian campaigns. But legend holds his body was secretly returned to Skyrim and buried with the crown. Its exact whereabouts lost in the following wars of succession. Through sources that shall remain nameless, I've tracked down what I believe to be the final resting place of King Borgas, Corvanjun. If the That's crown exists, it will be there. Uh, maybe it's just the skull in me, but it's pronounced Corvanjun. Chief Gran. So you think there's going to be danger? I think there's going to be Draugr. Aye. The Great Hunt killed old King Borgas. Gods only know with what profane arts those elves cursed his remains. Curses notwithstanding, the tombs of kings are always full of traps to ward off grave robbers, are they not? But nothing a band of Stormcloaks can't handle, I assure you. All right, let's go do it. Don't Fine. wait around for me. I'll send the I bet I'll you beat you to Corvanjun, even though can't you see start a crawl first. through a moldering dungeon to see if you can't stir up Garmar's jagged crown. It will be there. You'll see. Yep. It's good to see you again, Ulfric. Elmar. All right. I think I look pretty Stormcloak-like already. How about you? I mean, I'll go ahead and wear it. Alright, uh... It's not really a good place to change in here, is there? Eh, that's fine. I'm wearing stuff under this. I could just toss, uh, toss the... 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 Uh, the cuirass? Aye, that... On, over the stuff. Alright. Well, let's see if it fits you. Sure, this won't fit me. It looks way too small. Eh? Uh, uh, let's see. Eh? Uh... <laughs> uh, more good that. I I think I like the Dawnguard armor better, actually. But we could make it run out. So Rolf sees oh, me like Omar this, maybe not. Alright. Here, let me. Uh, let's, let's, I'll, I'll carry that for you. <laughs> I honestly didn't expect it to look quite that interesting. Alright, let's go get this Corvinjun going. Oh, not you too. My own granddaughter. <laughs> Alright, you lead ahead. We'll follow you. Uh, why follow me? Well, because you're the Dragonborn and I feel like staying behind you is the best idea. 
That's fair. Now... Uh, so test should be around here somewhere. Hi. What do you mean? Well... Uh, she told me she was gonna wait around and... Let me know when she and the guys were settled. Where did she go? Dragonborn, uh, it is my honor to stand before you. Uh, thanks. Just did, did you see her? No. <laughs> How hard is it to find a Khajiit in Windhelm? That's my question. It's a good question. As small as she is, uh It'll be interesting to see if we can find her. Uh-huh. Yep. Oh. What? <laughs> I, uh, I think I know where the boys are. Dragonborn. <laughs> it's an honor. Uh, how do you know? It's just a hunch. Uh, all right. I'll take your word for it. Once more, how hard is it to find... Oh! There you are! Ah, uh, I assume you worked things out with the, the Yarl? Yeah, we did. We are Stormcloaks now. Mordgood would be wearing the uniform, but it... It looked gods awful on me. Sorry. <laughs> I made promises, did not keep them. It's fine. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, she... You blend in! That is the point of the dark armor, don't you know? So, all of the boys are down in a little cupboard space thing. Uh... By the docks. So... Uh, we are ready whenever you have words to give us. Alright. Uh, we're gonna go deal with, uh, Cor- Corvenund. Corvenund. We're gonna go get a crown, and presumably bring it back. Uh, after that, I have no idea what will happen, so hold here, I guess. Alright, Khajiit will do her best to remain. Not bored. At least... Uh, anyway. Yeah, we'll just uh, hang out around here. Uh, Inigo and I might set up the stall. We might sell some be beans. Be on the lookout. The butcher could be around any corner. Uh, don't remind me. What grief. So, you have fun. We will uh, we will stay back here. Scope out the place. Hopefully not get uh, into too much trouble. All right. Uh, good luck? Eh, you're the one who needs luck. You're the one going into a dungeon in search of a crown. I like her. Alright. That'll do. Good grief. I may not be the worst in the worst shape, but you really need to let us catch up not go sprinting off into sorry <laughs> all right Corvenund. see who actually pronounced it right all right it's not that far Ugh. don't really want to be slogging through the fog though excuse me word is spreading like mage fire the great evil has been vanquished. You have truly saved us all. Ah, uh, that remains to be seen. Well, you did save us all from Alduin, so I s she, she's... Uh, sorry. She's got a point there. I'm not sure what's wrong with my brain today. It's just all over the place. Uh, it happens. Um. Give me a second. Uh, actually, I do not want to do this around town. 
It will cause a bit of a panic. What? Oh, maybe I don't need to. I know a shout to clear the... Oops. Uh, clear the skies out. I figure it would work on the fog, but... Looks like I don't need to. You can do all sorts of things with that voice of yours, huh? Yeah, pretty much. Right there? Yeah. Just, yeah. Having a moment. I can't believe we're actually doing this. Well, it's, uh. It's not turned into a war proper yet. I don't think either of us saw a single Imperial patrol on the road. Or Stormcloak, for that matter. Yeah, I feel like it's too early to tell, though. So that cat's a bit of a piece of work, isn't she? Uh, again? You alright? Yeah, I... I keep seeing the ghost of this dead orc. Here, what? Well, this one time- Oh. This- uh, he's still there. This one time I met an orc on the road. With a couple of dead saber cats with him. And he told me he was looking for a good death, and I figured, Hey, you know what? Going out fighting the dragonborn is as good a death as any. So- we fought, he died, he got his good death, and now I keep seeing his ghost everywhere. You know, that's absolutely not the strangest thing I've ever heard. Alright, uh, thanks, I think. God, it's, it's cold out. You don't seem particularly bothered by it, the cold. For a red guard, I mean, no offense. It's it's just, you know. <laughs> yeah, no, I know what you mean. We're not exactly built for this kind of weather, but you know. After going to literal sovereign guard, this <laughs> Uh, not that bad. I keep forgetting you actually went to Sovngarde. Did you happen to see an old man there? Oh, storm. Close. I saw a lot of old men in Sovngarde. Mostly dead. You wouldn't happen to have seen one in this armor, would you? Uh, I don't remember. Alright. Last mistake. Well, that was not what I was expecting. I have my moments. Good gods. Yeah, I'm learning that I have a bit of a temper. <laughs> no, really, the dragonborn who supposedly has the soul of a dragon has a bit of a temper. I can't say as I'm terribly surprised. Captain? Uh, is that the right... Eh, I, I don't know. I suppose I'll learn rank and file eventually, but... Hey, Wolf. Uh, 
Uh, don't worry about the wolves, they shouldn't attack you. Yeah, I've never had much of a problem with them. Uh, that's interesting. You, you don't, you, um... If, uh, it, uh... Any idea why you don't you have a problem with them? Uh, I, I don't really know. I... Something to do with kind, maybe. Right. Uh, speaking of people who talk to things and gods and stuff, I've got a friend, actually. Uh, acquaintance, actually, more like Speak it out, more good. Sorry. Uh, his name is... I forgot his name, I'm sorry. But, basically, he's, he is or was a priest of RK and actually talks to RK. So that's a thing. And he's in the Dawn Guard, I think? Aye. Uh, we are actually kind of growing in numbers. It's... Another one? Another one. Oh no, that's actually Dawnguard speaking. The... Huh. I'll be. Like trouble. And this is why you're taking point. Because of the spiked shield? Because of the spiked shield. Uh Oh, okay. We are almost there. Hopefully I don't get terribly lost. Hey dear. I was going to say before we got interrupted by that random Bosmer. Um, yeah, looks like we'll have to tell the boys to be careful. Hi. I, I assume you both realized the two of them are. Oh, yeah. I, we, uh, I kind of figured that out. Uh, over at the House of Troubles? Really? It took it that long? Well, I didn't remember about the, the, uh... The Wood Elf. Gods, I forgot his name. It's probably for the best, honestly. Hail, Hail, Hail Galmar. What's the situation? Rayla. I'm glad I'll have you beside me in there. This place chills my blood. And I don't care who knows it. Uh, it's good to see you again. God, it's been since Helgen. What are you, you uh, doing all right there? These old ruins. My father always told me to stay away from them. Good advice, I'd say. But never mind all that. We've got a job to do, and nothing's going to stand in our way. Cold Hi. as the inside of an ice race. That and some Imperials are camped out around the entrance, staying nice and warm around their fires. Imperials? Well, if they're keeping themselves comfortable, let's slip in and send them to their graves that way. <laughs> Good grief. What's the Legion doing here? Damn Imperial spies! Well, should be fun for us at least. They don't seem to know we're here yet. Ready to spill some Imperial blood for Skyrim? Uh... I suppose so. That's what I like to hear. 
Well, now we know where they all were. Listen up. Those Imperials aren't here by coincidence. Their spies must have found out we know about the crown, and they don't want us to have it. But they won't Claire, stand in our way. Think the Arden might I be know a spy. some of you are ex Legion, and uh, may know men on the other the side. But remember this they are the enemy now, and they will not hesitate to kill you. Keep your wits about you, and watch your shield brothers back. Ulfric Stormcloak is counting on us to bring him back that crown. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Follow me. Quickly and quietly now. I want my guts on the ground. As much as I don't trust the man, I don't think he's a traitor. Hey, that's fair. For the sons of Skyrim! Yo! Call yourself a uh, I will teach you to cross me. Dan? Uh, you coming? I, I, I just kind of lost track of Gran. And considering the circumstances, I'd rather not leave her behind, you know? Yeah, I do. Where she? Oh, are you coming? Yep, 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 yep. You s you still want me to take point, or we could follow your lead? Nah, Darth the Dragonborn, you've got this. That's hardly a reason. That's the way I like it. Short and bloody. They never knew what hit them. But do not make the mistake of underestimating the Legion. Plenty of them are Nords, same as us. We had the advantage of surprise this time, but things won't be so easy from here on out. Enough talk. Let's go kill some Imperials. You know, every time he says that, I just kind of cringe and think about him. I, I know that feeling. Yes, I do. Pick a man and put him down. We attack on my signal. Time to show what you're really made of. For Skyrim! You! And what are the ground? Uh. Uh. Kill you. Uh. Oh, I'll get the mage. Uh. We'll all get the mage. Greta, Engar, stay and guard Ow. the entrance. We don't want any Imperial reinforcements taking us by surprise. The rest of you lot are with me. How are you two doing? All right, do you get hit? No, I'm fine. Let's just go. Not a bad deal. Two for one. Ooh. Nice axe. I don't like the look of this. Perfect spot for an ambush. Ten to one. They're just waiting for us on the other side. But there isn't any other way through. Oh, you sure about that? Then please, be my guest and go strolling on in there. We'll stay here and watch your back. Not so sure. Oh, then perhaps we should take a moment to look around a little, eh? You there, unblooded. See if you can find another way through. We'll charge in to help as soon as we hear fighting. All right. Time to take counsel. Do we look around, or do we just charge it? Because... You're the Harbinger, and you're... pretty dang strong yourself, so... I mean, we could take the smart path, but you've got the shield. And Gren's got the mass. 
And by that, I mean, you know, the, that big heavy armor. I feel like taking the way around might be better. Although, to be fair, stealth is not exactly something either of us are good at. Yeah, that's a good point. Sorry, Galmar. Boys, there's girls here too. All right, that came out of nowhere. Where did Yarn Vita go? There she is. What in the nine holds is that? Hey, don't mind me. Draugr. Ain't you ever seen one before? Let's keep your no, eyes on more good if you would. Better off for it now, neither. <laughs> I'll do my best. Steady. A few dusty bone walkers aren't going to stop us any more than the Imperials could. We are not leaving until we get what we came for. Now let's keep moving. You hanging in there, Rayloth? Alright. Festive, doesn't it? Hey. Yeah. Stay out of the way of that axe, huh? Oh, hi. I'll have your head. Uh, actually, I'll have his head, but that's fine. <laughs> ah, I'm enjoying this way too much. That's bad. That's real bad. You go on ahead. There you are. Where's... Right here. You two... Keeping up alright? Well, uh, we're hanging in there, but keeping up. <laughs> you and Galmar just kind of charge in before any of us are ready. A hall of stories. We must be getting close now. Oh, I've heard of this. They say these walls show the history of the ancients who built this place. Too bad we can't read these carvings. Who knows what secrets we'd uncover. One thing at a time. We are here for the crown. Any of these carvings show a crown? Uh... Hmm. Technically? Looks like this is as far as the Imperials got. Even if one of these pictures tells us where the crown is, I'm betting we're going to have to find a way through that door. See what you can figure Easy out, enough. Unblooded. I'm going to check out these carvings over here. Hmm. That looks like some kind of claw. Yeah, I know how these work. I've done this song and dance before. Um... Fox Moth Dragon. A statue. That's funny. I wonder what it's used for. It would be funnier if it was a hawk. What are you on about? Good job. Dead. Uh, never mind. All right, everyone. Keep your guard up. Don't tell him what we'll find out here. I'm guessing, Droger. See what we've got. Stop calling us Unblooded. boys. Do what you do best. See if you can find some way to get that gate open. We'll uh hang out down here if you need us. All right. 
See if you can find something down here, I guess. How's it going, unblooded? You find anything yet? And try to keep Galmar in line, I guess. <laughs> no promises. I don't think any of us can control this bear of a man. How's it going, unblooded? You find anything yet? She just got started. Give her a break. Uh, I should probably be paying attention to where I'm going. What I'm looking for. Keep looking, unblooded. Just got to... I don't think anyone of us uses poison. Maybe say test, but she's not here. Hm. That'll do. That's done it. All right, boys, let's get. To it. We've got more. Steady now. They may be uglier than You all right? Come on. Yep, Let's yep, see yep. What's down this way. You kind of got lost in the scrum there. I'm fine. I don't think I got hit once. Looks... around here somewhere spread out and keep your eyes open that looks like the crown ah it also looks like a big nasty droger well, there's one way to settle this yo oh, he's a big scary bastard all right <laughs> Go down, you big bastard! Thanks. All right, get the crown off that drawer. Yes, sir. Get to Windhelm with the crown as quick as you can. Tell Ulrich he owes me a drink. What? We'll stick around oh. here for a while and see if we can find anything else useful. Be because he wasn't sure if it was here. Got it. Got it. Got it. Did either of you get hit? No, I'm good. I'm alright. Good. I can heal you as well as block for you. Just so you know. That might come in useful someday in the future. Oh, what's this? You got this look in your face? Are you right? Yeah, I can read the words sometimes. Only specific ones, though. And that is as much of an explanation as we're going to get. <laughs> I don't understand it any more than either of you do. Well, what did it say? Time. Said time. You said that all kinds of cryptically in intrigued. I'm surprised I took the right turn out on my first try. Nice. We've got the crown. Ugh, that was that was a long hike. Long fight. Reinforcements. Oh, that's a good thing. I wonder if your leaf got you know scared about the whole deal. I wouldn't put it past him. And that's gorgeous.
Don't worry, I'm keeping up. I'm keeping up. It's fine. Okay. Ah, uh, let's not get lost going back to Windhelm. How did we... That's how. Alright, we're good. I know where I'm going. Oh, excuse me? I'm a sailor on the North Wind. We're laying over in Windhelm for a while. Hey, there she is! Uh, still standing around. Don't mind me. I am totally not bored out of my mind right now. <laughs> Sorry. Did you get the thingy anyway? Yeah, we, we got the thingy. We should have more news shortly. Oh, good! Hopefully it will mean that we don't have to stand around waiting for you. No offense, of course. It's just this one he's used to. You know, speedy, speedy, get things done. Quick, quick, zoom. I like her. <laughs> I'm honestly quite not quite sure what to make of this little Kaji. Any idea how old she is? Uh, yeah, she's actually about my age. You've got to be kidding me. Nope, not at all. Sir, there continues to be unrest in the Grey Quarter. Blast to Dark Elves. I don't suppose you could tell them that I presently have larger concerns. See, this is what I was talking time. about. They don't seem to be very sympathetic to our cause, sir. Let me know if you hear anything more substantial. Of course, my lord. You see? He's not going to blame them for just not wanting to fight. He's not going to do anything awful to them. <clears throat> He just wants to be prepared, that's all. It's a little late to back down at this point anyway, isn't it? A little bit, yes. Alright. Alfric? Now that the Empire has been driven from the Reach, we can put a stop to the raping of her silver mines. That silver belongs in Skyrim. All right, uh, here's the Jagged Crown. I believe you owe Galmar a drink? Damn him. That old bear was right. Did you run into any trouble? Yeah, we ran into some Imperials that were, her that were there ahead of us, but nothing we couldn't handle. Damn it. What were they doing there? Imperial spies are everywhere, never forget that. I trust you gave them a thrashing. <laughs> now then, I'm glad you're here. I have a message I need delivered to the Jarl of Whiterun. Deliver this axe to Balgruff the Greater. An axe? Yes, an axe. How long have you been in Skyrim? Give the man my axe. If he keeps it, I will bide my time. If he returns it to you, <coughs> it means war. Oh, okay. I... I think I understand. Keep your wits about you. The Jarl of Whiterun is known for his temper. <laughs> Seemed to have much of a temper the last several times I talked to him. Okay, um... Let's go talk to the cat about this. Oh. Okay. You all right? Yeah, just distract. I always get distracted by these lights. You're uh not terribly pleased about having to take an axe to Balgraf, are you? No, nope, not at all. But I think I'm also just tired. That was that was a hell of a day. Hey, no kidding. So what's your plan? 
Um. I don't know. Ah, so what's the news? The news is... I'm going to stand over here while you talk because it's I nice I was one of the best soldiers in the Stormcloak army, until I took a sword to the chest. How are you still alive? No offense, I just... Ah... Uh... Oof. Anyway. Yeah, that was a little bit... Interesting. So, uh, new thing, I have to, or we have to, take an axe to Jarl Balgruf and uh, trying to come up with a plan. Uh, so take the axe to Balgruf. I don't see what the problem is. Yeah, that's fair. Um, I think, I think the question is, do we all go together or just me? I mean, to be fair, Balgriff didn't really care much for me while I was there. I could come with you if you want, but... Uh, do you... What about you, Morgan? Eh, uh, I just want to sleep. That was, as you said, a hell of a day. Yeah, that's fair. Alright, so I guess the plan is we'll head out to Whiterun in the morning and you keep an eye on the boys uh, more keeping of eyes on several boys <laughs> you doing all right Z? yes i'm doing fine i'm interested to see where all of this goes i'm a sailor on the north wind we're laying over in windhelm for a while interested to see how all of this goes and uh, just waiting just waiting for moments when we can be little, little stabby shadows in the dark. Because that is what we are good at, no? Uh, speak for yourself. I am speaking for myself. Okay, uh, uh, in that case, um, good night, I guess. Mm-hmm. There is no way I'm staying in Candlehearth, and I don't know if they will let Morgud in either. Well, if they don't, uh, they have to answer to me and Yarnvita. So! Well, it's I like it when you stand up for yourself like that. As if Skyrim didn't have enough outsiders. Now we've got mercenaries from Hammerfeld strutting about. Hey, she's the Dragonborn. Lay off. It's good to spend some time on solid land. <sighs> Maybe I was wrong about this. Still have to turn back now. <laughs>